Well, Chris, I can tell you police have since left the scene and school officials have lifted that lockdown uh, within the last hour or so, which students say ended about 40 minutes after school was actually supposed to let out. Now officials are offering more details into what happened in a letter just sent to families from the school's principal tonight. Sue Ann Bell said that threat came from someone off campus who said they were coming to the school to harm a student here. School officials say they worked with the Roseville Police Department to resolve the situation. The, principal letter, the principal's letter said no students were ever in any danger. Liberty Zamudio is a freshman at the school. She was inside when the school locked down. Well, we were in class our last period of the day and they told us to be quiet and they turned off the lights and they locked the door. And then eventually they told us that we were in lockdown. Um, I feel fine. There was nothing happened I've heard of and um, I'm safe and we're all safe. Nobody got hurt, so that's good. Now Zamudio tells me it was quite a uh, an anxious filled situation. Of course, students had no idea whether or not it was a drill or an actual situation, which we are learning tonight. Uh, it was prompted by some sort of actual threat. Meanwhile, students were released to nearby Mahaney Park where students picked them up. We have no word tonight on whether or not any arrests have been made. We'll be working with Roseville Police Department to get more information for you.